Taliban's launched a series of attacks on the Afghan capital. Several loud explosions have been heard in Kabul and gunfire has been heard near the U.S. Embassy. Attackers armed with rocket-propelled grenades and suicide bombs are reported to be aiming at government buildings. Let's talk to our producer, Abdullah Shahud, on the line from Kabul with the very latest. And what is that? What do you know, Abdullah? Um, thank you, David. Uh, the, uh, the complex attack started an hour or 45 minutes earlier. Um, uh, the report said that a known number of uh, Taliban suicide uh, uh, bombers uh, uh, have climbed a tall building uh, which uh, oversights ISAF headquarters and uh, Afghan in, uh, intelligence installments. And now we are hearing gunfire, and in the, in the last 45 minutes or so, uh, we have heard uh, several explosions and mortars landing near the U.S. embassy and the government uh, uh, buildings. Um, we, t we, we have no official confirmation about the uh, casualty, but there is chaos uh, around the, uh, um, the central parts of Kabul where there are a lot of government installments and, and buildings. Um, and now, we, uh, well, when I was coming to the site, uh, I saw a school van uh, which um, came under the attack uh, of shot with of a mortar. Uh, there were uh, some children in the van, uh, but obviously there were some people injured in that van as well. Uh, another mortar landed near an Afghan local TV station, uh, which had no injuries at all. Uh, the area has been cordoned off by Afghan uh, forces. Uh, the journalists are not yet allowed to... Uh, go near the site because there's still um, gunfires and bullets coming in. So, so is it possible, um, Abdullah, for you to, to give us an indication of, in terms of attacks in the capital, Kabul, what sort of size this seems to be and, and um, whether it is still continuing? Uh, oh, well, it is still continuing. We, we witnessed um, last month uh, uh, another uh, big attack by Taliban with, uh, on the British Council uh, building, uh, which killed at least 10 Afghans and, and, uh, and an international um, special force from the New Zealand. Uh, that attack lasted for, for at least 12 hours, and uh, it ended after 12 hours. So these sort of attacks may take longer time to end. Abdullah, thank you very much indeed. Uh, one of our team in Kabul.